Thanks for that, Brian. Animal welfare groups have condemned the people responsible for mistreating a dog they suspect was used as bait in a dog fighting contest in Cork. The Jack Russell is making a slow but painful recovery. Shots of morphine numb the excruciating pain. Nothing, however, can disguise the horrific injuries sustained by the little Jack Russell found dumped on the side of the road in County Cork. This is the true picture of animal cruelty in Ireland today. Vet Fiona and her staff continue to ask themselves how anyone could act in such a barbaric manner. Kind of being used as bait to, for fighting dogs, whether it's to get them used in training, to, to be fighting with another stronger dog, or just to, you know, to get them used to the, the, I suppose, the thrill of the fight. Um, just by the looks of his injuries, he's just lots of little bite wounds all over him and on his head, and just it looks like he had a bit of a, a rope mark around his back leg, which would suggest he was tied or dangled into into whatever other dog that he was fighting with. The rescued dog, now named Thor, was ravaged in attack after attack. One of his hind legs will have to be amputated. His wounds look like they've been there for at least a week, going on two weeks. So, and he, he's just really thin. He hasn't been fed properly or looked after at all. He was covered in fleas, um, just not looked after. The ongoing treatment will cost up to 2,000 euro. This is money animal welfare groups just don't have. We welcome the animal welfare bill, of course we do. Um, the enforcement of it is a different story and you know these people need to be caught and they need to be prosecuted for what they're doing to, to innocent animals, you know. Thor has a long road to recovery, but those who rescue dogs know it's only a matter of time before they encounter the next badly treated animal. Paul Byrne, the 530 Cork.